Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It hasn't been that long, but it's been pretty long. Um, today's video is just going to be a 12-week update. Of course, you know I'm pregnant and a kind of wig review, if that makes sense. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. So, about a week ago, I seen a girl post a video up. And because I was looking for something cheap and affordable, I was trying to get cute. I was like, I really want some color. Like, I don't want to wear black, my, my natural hair color. Well, actually brown, but I didn't want to do that. And I looked up and I seen this video of this girl. She posted wig review. The wig was like $40. and But the color is what drew me to the wig. It wasn't like that. It was $40. I am a cheapskate, though, for this offer. I was like, $40? That's good. You can't beat that. So, I watched the video, and it was legit. It was actually literally $40 because I went and purchased the wig, as you can tell. And it was this beautiful car copper color. And, of course, it's synthetic. It's $40. Like... What do you expect? This is not going to be no human hair. This ain't going to be no bomb, bomb human hair, Brazilian, whatever you want to call it. So this is 100% synthetic. I'm almost positive. It feels like it. And yeah, I'm just going to do, I'm just going to try it on for you guys and do my little personal review of it and talk about basically being 12 weeks pregnant and how that's been for me so far. So, I'm going to start first with saying what all came in the bag. Well, I'll say how everything came. So, the wig came in this bag. This black bag right here. Like I said, it was $40. Um, I don't want to steal the girl shine and put the link below because she did the exact same thing. But, I mean, it was a... I don't know, but you can find the wig on Amazon if you're looking for something. Like, this ain't for you to be bougie and like, oh, I'm trying to freaking, you know, like, I don't, I don't know. But this is probably like a, something simple, just throw on wig. This ain't no, oh, I want to go to freaking, you know, somewhere. Like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but it came in this net and it came with this kind of fishnet wig cap which I have on in this bunny and then this was inside there so that's everything it came with it didn't come with no lashes no stuff like that like I said it was only $40 what do you expect so let's just get started on this texture of this hair the texture <clears throat> y'all I think it's just because I don't know how to take care of stuff but, like, the texture is, of course, it feels, like I said, synthetic. Like, y'all, don't be expecting no freaking uh, $200 wig right here. This is $40. So, but it's good for $40. Like, look at that. Like, if you, like, if you feeling what I'm trying to say. And this is not what I'm supposed to be <laughs> using to freaking tame this. But this is all I got. I couldn't find my wig brush. I don't know where my weed brush is. So, I'm just getting the knots out because I, I don't know how to take care of stuff for some unknown reason. Wigs especially. <clears throat> so, this is just me combing through it. And as you can see, like, of course, it sounds synthetic. Looks like it's synthetic. Like, but it's just, it's so pretty. Like, it is so pretty. And I think I'm going to wear it like this for, like, a couple days. Like, well, a couple months, and then after that, I've decided I'm gonna cut it into like a little short bob, and I think that's gonna be so cute. But without further ado, I'm gonna get into actually, well, I'm gonna show y'all the inside of this wig. So it came with three clamps one, two, three. This little thing, y'all, I really don't even know what this stuff be for, but I be snapping it together. I don't even know if this is how you're supposed to be doing this, but I snap it together. 
and then it, it really ties the wig when you put it on so i went ahead and snapped it together i cut the lace already did not do a good job don't know what the hell i was doing so yeah um but i'm gonna put on some foundation or i might not i don't think i am I might just pop on some lipstick. Can I say lipstick? I'm sorry about you and grown y'all, but this pregnancy, I'm at the point where Saliva comes out of my mouth like crazy. TMI, TMI, I know. But saliva be coming out of my mouth like crazy. If you're pregnant or haven't been pregnant before, you know what I'm talking about. Like, it's ridiculous. And it's really getting on my nerves for real. So instead of saliva, saliva coming out of my mouth, I'd rather chew gum, trust me. So I'm putting foundation on the frontal, on the lace. Um... Hopefully it blends in with my skin tone. I put it on recently and it did not blend in, of course. Because it was like a light color, of course. Common sense. But um I'm gonna put this on and then I'm gonna talk about my twelve weeks and things like that. Things of that nature. So yeah, let me put this on and be right. Okay you guys, so this is the wig on. This is no no nothing done to it no part no what you want to call it um plucking none of that so well i did no no i didn't do anything so this is it um trying to be with, as gentle as possible with it like i said it is synthetic so be careful where you sit it but honestly it is like i think it's fiber synthetic that's what it feels like fiber synthetic so this is no part, no nothing. And it's free part, to my knowledge, of course. You can part it wherever you want to. So I wore this recently and I uploaded a video on Snapchat and you could tell, like you could see the lace in the video. So I'm finna try to blend that in the best way possible. But I love it. Like, I love the color. I've always wanted a copper color. My mommy wouldn't let me dye my hair copper. But <clears throat> this is some foundation. Of course, my skin tone. And I'm just going to take it and just try to blend it. Blend it. And I don't know if I want to do side part, middle part. I had a side part yesterday and I thought that was super duper cute like, like so 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 cute I think that looks better so what I'm gonna do since it's a free like part thingy I'm gonna do the middle part and the side part and I'm gonna see which one I like best not gonna do my edges don't know how to do my edges like that I thought about it but I don't know how to do them. So I'm not going to try to do them. Y'all, that's crazy. I literally don't know how to do my edges. So I'm going to swoop a part in here. And I love that it's just, I don't know, like, you got to, of course, be careful with it. But it's it's not hard to t detangle. Like, like, you see that? Like, that's how I can tell it's like fiber synthetic it's not just regular synthetic it's fiber synthetic and it just bounces back like the curves just bounce back yeah and they're not they're not freezy that makes sense i'm sorry for not looking at the camera y'all i do that all the time okay so this is side part i'm not gonna put no foundation not foundation but concealer on it First off, because I don't know which part I want to wear first. I don't know which part I want to wear yet. 
Oh yeah, and this wig is, I think, 24 inches, if I'm not mistaken. So, let me pull it all to the front. Ooh. And as you can tell, it's a lot. So, that's why I said I think I'm really going to cut it instead of just leaving it this length. Like, look at that. There's so much hair. It's cute. You can keep up with it, but I know me and I know this thing is probably going to be like thrown around and stuff. I keep on figuring to look at the camera. But yeah, so this is final look. I literally love, I'm in love with the color. If I'm not in love with anything else, it's the color. And... This is actually a onesie, you guys. I wanted to show you guys. Well, you can't really see my stomach, but I got a little, little pudge. <laughs> so, as you can tell, I have started showing a little bit. This is not tight on me. Not tight. Um, my pregnancy... Things are starting to get better. <laughs> Thank God. I'm so tired. Um, my nausea has came to a kind of good place. I used to throw up like literally four times a day. Like past two or three weeks. Last last two or three weeks I used to throw up like three, four times a day. I had no energy. Like literally none. So much stuff was going on. And I have some exciting news that I'll probably be sharing on another video. Because this video is basically dedicated to the wig and talking about my pregnancy. And that has nothing to do with my pregnancy. Well, it does, but in the long run, not right now. But yeah, so. Yeah, pretty much. So this is it. This is the side part. Like I said, not going to um, pluck it or anything yet. I don't even have any tweezers. So, yeah. And so, once I get some tweezers, I'm going to pluck it and all that. And I'm also going to do a full makeup video. So, make sure y'all look out for that. Full makeup video, I'm talking about, I'm going to do my eyeshadow. I've never done this stuff before. That's what's interesting about it. Like, I've never done an eyeshadow. i never applied lashes. I've never, um, I've never done my makeup right, if that makes sense. Because me, I'm the basic foundation concealer whatever throw a little highlight on my nose like i don't i don't even know where the freak this stuff is supposed to go half the time so i'm gonna what i'm gonna do for my next video is i'm gonna have my laptop playing somebody's makeup tutorial and i'm gonna follow that whole tutorial to the t i'm not gonna buy everything they buy because they probably gonna have some expensive stuff but i'm probably just gonna get some little products that i can afford and i'm gonna do a makeup video and it's gonna be nice because i've never done it before so that's gonna be something new and cool but yeah and that should be coming up super duper soon and this onesie this is actually a onesie you guys it's like shorts but i'm kind of naked right here. but it's um it's a onesie and i got this from if i'm not mistaken maybe sheen I think I got it from Sheen, if I'm not mistaken. I really do not remember. But it's really cute. Of course, it's like a little bed onesie, you know, if you want to get cute for your man or whatever. But, yeah. So, and honestly, I'll probably cut this to, like, right here, like a little short bob. <laughs> so, I really wish I had a brush because I don't want to mess up these curls. So, like I said, this is it. This is the side part. I'm going to attempt the middle part because we're just going to see. <clears throat> so, Mm. 
Yeah, how this middle part is giving me like, I don't know, bad girl vibes. <laughs> like, <laughs> I love the middle part. I'm not even gonna cap to you. Well, future middle part because it's not really a middle part yet. You gotta pluck it and stuff. But if my edges were done, like I'm talking bad, like, like. Baby says, I'm sorry, baby. Dang. But yeah, so I honestly love the middle part. And that's what the girl did in the video. She did a middle part. And she had all that fancy stuff like the free spray, which I actually, <laughs> not really fancy because I actually have it myself. I have the free spray myself. But I'm not, I'm not going to be wearing this long. This is just for this video. Like, <laughs> This is not, you know, to be wearing, wearing right now. Because, you know, that's to go see my mans and stuff soon. So, when I go see him, then I'll put this on. But other than that, I'm giving myself vibes right now. And it's really cute. It's, and it's not hard to deal with. Usually, synthetic wigs have been tangled up. And it's, y'all no shedding like that's another good thing about this i cut it when i cut the lace you had to like you cut it to your head size or whatever and it was like the lace was like all the way down here so of course you got to cut across and cut it to fit your head so when i cut it that was the only time it shed like literally the only time it shed and it like other than that i promise y'all like invest like even if you like, this could be something cute for, like, a little, you want to go out on a little dinner date and you don't have nothing. Like, you you want to be spontaneous. Like, that's, that's why I love color. And I want to dye my hair so bad, especially this color. But my mama wouldn't let me. But that's another story for another day. So, honestly, I really don't know what else to say. Tried on the wig. Showed you the wig. Talked about my pregnancy a little bit. Didn't talk much. I know. Y'all like the oh yeah, comment in the section. Um comment down below if you like the middle part or you like the side part. Now that I'm looking at it, I actually like the side part better. <laughs> I like the side part better. And I love the fact that it's blending in. Like look at that. Like you can't like unless you were just all in my face, you would not be able to tell. It's just so okay, so. and I love the fact that when I just swoop this over, oh, and that'll be so cute, you know, like a little like have it up. If you y'all get what I'm trying to do, you see it like have it up and then have some down, half up, half down, you act right like that. Ooh. This indigestion is killing me. Okay, yeah. I like the side part better. So, I'm choosing the side part. What do you think? But, um, moving on, talking about my pregnancy. I don't be trying to make these videos long, y'all. I promise you I don't. But, um, 12 weeks. My baby is the size of a lime. Baby is growing. Lime, if you don't know, is about that big. No more, no less. So my baby is big. And she's going to start, well, she or he is going to start kicking soon. And I know I discussed and talked about the fact that I haven't been to the doctor yet. And that still stands. I have not been to the doctor yet. They, I called up there to schedule an appointment. And they have made my appointment for December the 26th. The day after Christmas. That's when my appointment is. And I will be faithfully wearing this wig. So, yeah. So, yeah, by then, I will be 13 weeks. 
and my baby will probably be starting to move and stuff like that. So I'm gonna be super duper excited and I will update update you guys on how that goes. And yeah. So that's pretty much that. Like I said, my symptoms are starting to, I'm just feeling way better than I was. Like I was depressed, I was stressed, I was like in a I was at a low point in my life and I had people reaching out to me, you know, trying to be there for me and it really wasn't helping. But now I feel better. I went on a little date recently. Not really a date. But I went and spent the night with my boyfriend for like two nights and it was amazing. He catered to my needs, whatever I wanted, he went and got it wanted food he went and got it like stuff like that and and i actually ate pizza for the first time and he was so happy to see me eat because you know i just haven't been eating anything and i've been losing weight like i lost 20 pounds literally i lost 20 pounds y'all and i'm already not that big so it shows like it showed that i had lost weight and i really didn't like that because you know i'm a thick juicy girl like i like to be juicy i want to be juicy and so when I lost the weight, I really made me sad. And so that's what that was my real wake up call. It was like I gotta do better, especially for my child, not just for me, cause I, you know, I want to be juicy. I want to be thick, cause I lost my butt, and that's a big problem. It's a huge problem. Made me sad. So yeah, I went out recently. Like I said, we spent the night. So the whole time I was really just in the hotel sleeping. But then I had things to do, so like I go do my things, come back and go to sleep. Like, you know, so he was he was super duper helpful and just the sweetest person ever. So yeah, you'll be hearing a lot about him more. <laughs> and I say him as in my boyfriend and not my baby daddy. So it, it's 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 been hard, but that whole situation was super duper toxic for me with him. But the tea on that will be on another video. So make sure y'all stay tuned. But yeah, so um, he actually stepped up and he's been doing so awesome. And he's been showing me, you know, how I'm supposed to be treated. I've never been treated like that before. I've never been spoiled before. I've never, you know, like I've never like seriously and so it's like it's refreshing for me so i don't know and it's hard to get used to but i have to adapt especially when i did i know i deserve that like i've been through so much like with my mom me being pregnant me the baby daddy not being in the life like i've been through so much so for him to just be able to take take that from me and take that that pain and that that depression and stress away from me as much as he can and try it's so sweet to me so yeah that is that on this video thank you so much for watching and make sure you stay tuned for the next one